Before I start this piece of art, I'd like to take you through a bit of theory. It's conceptual stuff, and it's short enough, but even so, I'm going to sing it so to stop it getting dreary. So sit up straight, concentrate, don't laugh, you'll only make the place untidy. For here comes Bertolt Brecht, and we expect your essays to be handed in on Friday. Karl Marx was a German fella. In 1867 he wrote a real bestseller. It's a capital work, packed with wit and wisdom, concerning economics in a capitalist system where the rich get fat and surplus value is expropriated by the proletariat. The very hands in which, ironically, that value was first created. Which means that money is made by nicking it from those who generate it. Bert Brecht is a name that's dear to any Joe who dips his toe in socialist theatre. No one ever did more. And Big Bad Bertie Brecht did in dramatic realizations of a Marxist dialectic where he re creates the historic struggle of the working classes in such a way that a the ornate and so denies a viewing public Aristotelian catharsis. Which means that you lot ought to get up off your video watching asses. So, to Puntilla and Matty, Matty is a working man and Puntilla's a fatty and it features some scenes of humorous behaviour performed against a backdrop of a mythic Scandinavia where the pine trees throng. There's scarcely room to scram another tree in and summer evenings last so long. And in scene one, Mr. Puntilla discovers a human being. A human being. A human being. Well, I'm off. I think that's where we'll leave it. Puntilla wants freedom, but it's tricky to achieve it. When you hop between power and sentimental boozing, unable to acknowledge that the privilege of choosing all depends on cash. And face it, if you're loaded, then you're laughing, and all the rest is ball the dash. To talk of misty-eyed utopias when half of the world is starving. And as for Matty, the fact of the matter is that he gets another job and drives some other bloke's Bugatti. But he will only find a boss who actually cares when he becomes the master. When we become the masters. When all of us are masters of our own affairs.